So today we're going to look at what it takes to get a good stand of alfalfa or grass. Some farmers always get good stands and some farmers have more problems getting good stands. So what are the key characteristics that they have to think about to get a good stand to be able to end up with a field like we have behind me here? The important things that we have to think about are first having a weed-free stand to start in, then to have the field leveled, then to have it packed so that we have soil that is firm and that your soil doesn't sink in more than a quarter of an inch, and then to place the seed at the proper depth. Uh, as we, long as we pay attention to those factors, we will get a good stand most of the time. The first important thing is to have the field tilled well. As you see behind me here, we want to have a weed-free surface, and then we also want to have it be reasonably firm so that the sole of the shoe does not sink in more than a quarter of an inch. If the soil is too loose, then when we put the seed in the soil, the seed does not have good contact with the soil and won't take up water and we get a poor stand. So packing the soil around the seed is crucial. Uh, the second thing that we want to pay attention to then is appropriate seeding depth. And what we are looking at is that we want alfalfa and grasses in that quarter to half inch range in most of our soils. We can go a little bit deeper in sands, but generally we're thinking of a quarter to half an inch. This means that we should see some seeds on the surface after we're done. If we, we should go back and look and we should see approximately four or five seeds per square foot on the surface of the soil after we've seeded. If we do not see any seeds, then we have probably put all of the seed too deep. So here is a stand of alfalfa that was seeded about three weeks ago. Uh, it was seeded at about 12 pounds per acre. And as you can see, there is a plant along here coming up in this row about every inch. Uh, that is a more than adequate stand for alfalfa. We would look at if we have about 40 plants per square foot, that's a good stand. And then uh, all of those stands will fit thin down to about 30 to 35 plants per square foot at the end of the seeding year. So here, here is a spot where the seeding rate is really unnecessarily high. Uh, this must have been about a 20 pound seeding rate and if you look you can see that there are three to four plants per inch of row. Uh, this will give us uh, way more plants than that 30 to 40 that we need for the end of the year. So this stand comes up now, it looks very good, but the fact is the plants are competing against each other and the stand will gradually thin down to 30 to 35 plants by the end of the seeding year.